Hello everyone and today I am going to be telling you a story about my weird and unusual life. Cause I know one day you'll be screaming my name and I'll just look away. That's right. Just go ahead and hate on me and run your mouth so everyone can hear. Hit me with the words you got and knock me down. Baby, I don't care. Keep it up and turn it up and bring it around. You won't not be, you won't not be a loser like me. Yes. Okay. So I'm going to tell a story about the time that I messed up with a cute guy, Chick-fil-A. So let's jump into it. That was so dumb. Here is the story, the hardcore story and all the facts. So there was a night that me and my best friend Mallory and best friend Cynthia were going to go see Thor 2. And keep in mind, this is the first time that me, Mallory, and Cynthia had seen each other in a month. Or not in a month, like months. Month, month, S's. But it was like the first time we have seen each other in a long time because Mallory's off at college, Cynthia's working, and then I'm at high school. So we like hardly ever get to see each other. So we all get together and we're gonna go see Thor too. So we pick up Cynthia and we're like, we wanna go eat beforehand. So we're like, hey, let's go to Chick fil A. Go into Chick fil A and there is this cute boy working behind the counter. Like, he got that bow tie swag because bow ties are cool. And he was looking pretty good that day. Obviously I'm like, oh my god Mal, look at that guy, he's so cute. And she's like, calm down. So I go up to order and I get like a number five meal which is I think chicken nuggets. I got chicken nuggets and everything. So I get my drink and I'm waiting and then he calls me back up there. So I go up there and he was like, would you like any sauce with that? Again, I must enunciate how attractive this young gentleman was. It's quite attractive. Think of like a mixture of the young Leonardo DiCaprio and like Justin Timberlake rolled into one. It was great. So he's like, what kind of sauce do you want to go with that? And I just, I was looking at him and thinking about how cute he was. And before I know it, the first thing that came out of my mouth was chicken. And then I was like, oh crap. Crap, that's the wrong answer. So by that point, I was like totally embarrassed, and he was looking at me like a crazy person. And I was like, no, I'll just, I'll take honey mustard. It's okay. And then I heard him whisper off in the distance, well, we have Chick-fil-A sauce. Now, of course, every time I go there, he's there. And I guess I'm just known as that weird girl who wanted chicken sauce. Mmm, tasty. So that is my really unusual and hysterical life story for today. I hope you guys enjoy me embarrassing myself. And yeah. So I will talk to you guys later. Thank you so much for watching. I love you all and have a very Merry Christmas.